a bear? Are you a pretty bear? What is this? Yeah, oh my God, by the way, everyone at my wedding was like, what are these nails? These are incredible. They're gorgeous. I'm like, oh! And it sounds like So instead of using my Nail Thoughts Clear Builder Base, I wanted to use something just a, even a little stronger just because her nails are really long and they're very strong as well. And this specific base coat is literally made for that type of nail, long and strong. So I wanted to give it just a little bit of extra strength to support it while they're growing to be really long. So that's what I'm doing here. I wouldn't recommend using this base coat on people with really weak nails because it would lift because the nails can't support something this strong unless they are like this, like these nails, long and strong. All right, carry on. So whatever you want, okay. truly, All which right. I know is like Hard. pressure. That's I'm not right. trying to put you under any pressure. It's okay. No, it's okay. It's fine. It's fine. <laughs> it's fine. No, it's okay. It's fine. No worries. No worries. Also, listen, there's something so satisfying with applying white gel, especially when it's like a good white gel, not to toot my own horn, but this is the Nail Thoughts white gel. It's called Fresh Sheets. <laughs> toot toot, you know? I mean, just look how creamy it applies, but even just like putting white gel on in general, like I love how like I really am forced to take my time and get those cuticles nice and like crispy and clean and the gel just like self levels so nicely and doesn't leave streaks and shadows and I don't know I'm just obsessed with it and that's why I kept a bunch of clips of me applying it in this video <laughs> enjoy
Um, like this, I learned from one of the like Coco's instructors. She's like a, a master instructor in Japan. And she's like an expert at the inks. And so she brought us each these. And she taught us that before. Like I've seen her do it, but I, and I tried to make my own little palette, but I couldn't, I didn't understand. It wasn't working for me. And so I was like, oh my God, she made me one, oh my God. <laughs> and so now I'm like, okay. All right, and then this specific client was a fast one, which was really nice because I was running behind after that first one. <laughs> I took my time with that last one. Um, but this one, she just wanted like chromey, fun, blobby accents. So what I did was I put a layer of peach base on her nail and matte top coated it. Then I used like a chrome clear and drew little blobs that you couldn't really tell and took my little chrome pen and rubbed it in on top of the chrome clear that I used. I'll link it below. <laughs> um, and then, yeah, and then I just dusted off all the excess chrome and then put top coat on and it was just such an easy, quick manicure because it was like tinted base gel, chrome blobbies, boom, done. Super cute. I kind of want them on my nails now.
This is very folly. Very cool. And the last one was kind of another long one, just because fine lines take a long time. Um, but it was my last one, and I was like, let's do this. She wanted anti-hero nails. But the specific part in the music video, everyone watching this is like, honestly, one more Taylor Swift reference, and I'm going to unsubscribe. <laughs> this will be the last one. Just kidding. It's not. Um, she wanted the specific part of the video where like she gets shot with the arrow and then purple glitter comes out. So I was like, okay, let me do like the shirt print and then purple glitter going over it. I don't know. You'll see. You'll see.